Non-invasive ventilation connections on the SLE 6000 using Fisher and Paykal F&P circuit. The SLE 6000 can be used for non-invasive ventilation and high-flow oxygen therapy if these modules are installed on the ventilator. Non-invasive ventilation on the SLE 6000 can be applied using dual limb or single limb patient circuit configurations, depending on the user's preference or clinical scenario. All non-invasive modes, including oxygen therapy, can be applied by simply adapting the SLE 6000 patient circuit and using the appropriate patient interface for that mode. Nasal CPAP, NIPPV, triggered NIPPV, and nasal high-frequency oscillatory ventilation can be used with a dual-limb patient circuit configuration using the SLE mini-flow adapter. Nasal CPAP and GeoPAP modes can be used with a single-limb circuit configuration using a nasal CPAP generator. Oxygen therapy can be used by using the nasal cannulas supplied by SLE. Dual limb, F and P. Connect a Fisher and Paykal SLE 6000 patient circuit to the ventilator. To connect the SLE mini flow to the patient circuit, detach the inspiratory and expiratory tubes from the Y piece. Make sure that the yellow restrictor is still connected to the end of the inspiratory limb. Put the Y piece assembly to one side. Now connect the blue connector to the expiratory tube of the patient circuit. This can be found in the SLE breathing circuit package. Connect the inspiratory and expiratory limbs to the connections of the SLE mini flow. Select the appropriate mini flow accessories for your patient and you are ready to use dual limb non-invasive ventilation. In single limb mode, the expiratory limb is not used. So first remove the proximal airway tube and disconnect the expiratory limb. Disconnect the tube that contains the yellow restrictor from the rest of the inspiratory limb of the SLE 6000 patient circuit. Add the blue connector to the inspiratory limb. Put the remaining part of the patient circuit to one side. Connect the inspiratory limb to the inspiratory connector of the single limb NCPAP generator. Make sure that the yellow restrictor is not in place. Connect the proximal airway tube to the proximal sensor connector of the single limb NCPAP generator or first breath generator. Select the appropriate accessories for your patient and you are ready to use single limb non-invasive ventilation with your SLE 6000. Oxygen therapy. In oxygen therapy mode, the expiratory limb and proximal airway tube are not used, so first disconnect both from the ventilator end. Disconnect the tube that contains the yellow restrictor from the rest of the inspiratory limb of the SLE 6000 patient circuit. Use the RT064 adapter. Connect the adapter to the inspiratory limb. Attach the cannula to the adapter. Make sure the yellow restrictor is not connected. Now you're ready to use high-flow oxygen therapy mode.